This is Derek Revis once again, and I'm at. Uh, this is Derek Revis with Film the Police. Notice the three people standing there without cameras. The only difference between these guys and Derek was the fact that he was documenting. Same deal goes for the guy that just walked by. He was also allowed to go through unmolested by the police. Don't worry, this is on your computer. Take y'all. Gotcha. I shouldn't be And I'm at the corner of uh, 10th Street North and Curry Avenue. There's a police line here. There's a gentleman being arrested, looks like. Oh, no. He's having his blood check. Notice how Derek is still on the correct side of the police line. I'm trying to get a little bit more after the description here of what's going on. Um, We got a police officer here checking a bag or something. Hey, guy, get on the sidewalk. Get off the sidewalk. I am on the sidewalk. At this point, Derek has been given two contradictory orders. Hey guy, go down the sidewalk. Get off the sidewalk. I'm on the sidewalk. What? You say get off the sidewalk. Yeah, go down the sidewalk. I'm shutting the sidewalk off. So let's go down the sidewalk. All right, can you not put your hand on me, please? Yep. The loud crash you just heard was the cop violently snatching the camera out of Derek's hand. In the next segment, you can clearly hear the cop say, quote, we're not going to stand here and film. Go down the sidewalk and I'll give you your camera back. Can you give me my go. camera? Can you We're not going to stand here and film. You can go down the sidewalk and I'll give you your camera back. To try and make sense of this, I think it's very important to review the first few words that were exchanged between Derek and the police. Hey, guy. Down the sidewalk. Get off the sidewalk. I am on the sidewalk. What? I'm on the sidewalk. What? You say get off the sidewalk. Yeah, go down the sidewalk. I'm shutting the sidewalk off. So let's go down the sidewalk. All right. Can you not put your hand on me, please? Yep. It took this cop exactly 17 seconds to determine Derek and his camera was a threat that had to be removed. Bear in mind, Derek was on the correct side of the police line. Okay. You know this is a take your own sweet time. This is a police, you violate, you violate police matter. Right. Police order. Okay, get off the well, sidewalk. You're violating my right. We're on the sidewalk. How far do you want me to go down? I have a right to be here. I have. 
As you can see in this freeze frame, Derek has walked quite a distance from the crime scene. See the police line in the far right of the screen? I have the right to be here. This is my first right amendment. Now, our main concern is the safety of those people. Alright? Okay, we well I'm making sure I, I'm making you sure nobody get away from here. I'm making sure nobody's rights are being violated. Here. I'm on I'm on dude! You've been told to leave. You can't Ow! You've been told to leave. Okay, I'll leave. I'll leave. Damn it, too late. Give me your other hand now. Give it to me. Hey, Give me your other hand. Give it to me quick. There you go. I was leaving. There you are. Get up, I have a right to see you. You got any needles on you? No. Blades? No. Go on your side. Stay right there. Right here? I have another pocket on this side. You have what? I have a pocket like right this. A what? A pocket. A pocket? All I was doing was screaming. No, you when you're told to leave. I was about to leave. I, I asked him how far he wanted me to go. And I did. Yeah. I think I will leave my wife. Hey, shut up. This is a note for Derek's lawyer. It's important to measure the distance from this metal pole to the corner to determine how far Derek has walked from the crime scene. Thanks to Google Maps, I've been able to reasonably determine what the metal pole actually is. It's a parking meter. Notice in side view the three metal rings at its base. Here's the same metal pole as shown on Google Maps. Here's the street view from Derek's perspective. To get a better idea of where exactly Derek is, check out the stoplight behind the officer. Here's the same traffic light as seen on Google Maps. I hope this information helps Derek's lawyers sue the living feces out of these cops. Get the wall over there. Can I stand up? No, you can sit down until Dan gets here, but you can lean up against the wall. If that's more comfortable for you. Oh. Ah, these things went tight on me. Because much like the rest of your evening, you're screwing around. No, what's well, not? Oh, I'm sorry, you were just leaving work? No, I'm oh, you're walking around, yeah, around to dinner with your family? I'm walking around filming. Is this all your stuff? Is this your bag? No, that's not my bag. What do you what do you got over here? Excuse me? What all what all is yours? I don't that's know what's trash and what's yours. The cigarettes are mine, the pen is mine, uh, the back piece that you just dropped. And your your yeah. name your name is Derek? Yes. I don't have any warrants. Derek was arrested and charged with interfering with a police officer. Personally, I think he was singled out because he was documenting. This kind of blatant disregard for the First Amendment and citizen journalism must be put a stop to.